Hi everyone, I'm Nadia and in today's video my mom is making a beautiful teal and gold resin bowl with matching resin coasters. In this video she's going to be using J Diction's 4 hour demold resin. My mom has a 10% off discount code and I'll leave that in the description. I think it's really cool that you can demold your piece in just 4 hours which is a lot sooner than other resins. It's a 1 to 1 ratio by volume. So my mom is pouring in the whole bottle for each part. And she mixes it together for a few minutes. Then she separates it into smaller cups to add in her pigments. The first pigment she's going to be using is a gold mica powder and she takes a small amount onto a wooden stick and mixes it into her cup of resin. Next, she mixes in a blue shade of mica powder and she also mixes in a blue transparent pigment. Then she moves on to a greenish teal shade of mica powder and also adds in transparent pigment as well. All of these pigments are also from J Diction, so make sure to check out the discount in the description. I'll also have links for molds and other equipment, so check that out too if you're interested. Next, she mixes the two blue and greenish transparent pigments together. And she leaves two cups of clear resin. Now that all of her pigments are mixed and ready, she starts by pouring the gold pigmented resin around the edges of the mold. Followed by the blue pigmented resin. And next is the teal pigmented resin. And then the transparent pigmented resin. Lastly, she pours clear resin into the center of the mold. She uses a torch gun to pop any air bubbles and if you're using a torch gun just be careful to move it very quickly so that you don't burn your resin or your silicon molds. And she goes back in circles around the mold a couple more times. She follows the same steps while pouring into the coaster molds. And she comes back with the blue and teal pigmented resin and circles around the mold some more. Then she uses a heat gun to help the pigmented resin move into the center more. Now 
now she's going to be mixing in her center detail and she's using these blue and green glitter flakes as well as gold leaf flakes. She mixes it all together in a small cup of resin and then adds it into the center of her molds. She uses the heat gun once more and makes some final touches before covering her piece to come back to later. You'll always want to make sure to cover your resin piece so that no dust particles or fibers fly into your piece while it's hardening. And here she is just 4 hours later demolding. Now that the tray is out of the mold, she places some plastic wrap onto the bottom side and then shapes it into a large bowl. Then she demolds her coasters. She comes back the next day and with the plastic wrap is able to easily remove the resin bowl from the bowl. And here's the final product. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, subscribe to see more videos like this in the future. Follow me on my Instagram, Summer Girl Designs, and my mom's Instagram, Wild Heart Resin Art.